Hello everybody. I just want to show you Bob is relaxing on the beach at my trailer. I just wanted to show you my table made it to the trailer. It's in between my two chairs and we'll bring you out so you can see where it is. Ah, there it is between my two chairs. It looks tight, but that's because I had to move things around so I could get my stuff in here. But I had to show you because everybody was asking and I haven't changed the lampshade yet. It's still the way it was. So I brought my American flag to show the husband. I hope you all enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun making it. So, but here we go. Here's the blingy trailer cup. Hello, my beautiful people. I hope you're having an amazing Wednesday. Um, so I'm here at the trailer, as you can see, I am trying to do a couple of videos. I am finding such a hard time trying to figure out a routine now that I'm back to work. Because I'm finding I get up at 3 to start doing some videos. And I, I tell you, I get home from work at 3 in the afternoon and I am dead to the world. So I can't do nothing. <laughs> so I have to find a happy medium. So I brought all of my stuff back to the trailer. So we're going to do a um, another pour with these paints. Hopefully I can get it to work. I actually, I quite enjoyed the last one. I think it turned out actually quite nice. And yeah, hopefully I don't get any weird comments on this one. But that's the facts of life, right? When you're um, putting yourself out there. So with that, I'm going to prep my cameras and get everything ready. And I'll see you guys when I'm all ready. I always lose the button. I'll see you in a minute, guys. Hello, we are back. I have everything set up. <clears throat> so these are the two kits that I purchased. There was the blues and greens, and then there was the kind of purpley pinks and the blue. So I'm going to do um, these little ounce glasses, two ounces. I'm going to pour enough paint in each one to fill them. I'm going to, this is my silicone oil. If you watched the last video, my lid was broke and for transportation purposes, so I could get back to the trailer with it, I put it in my squeeze bottle and actually I think I'm gonna put the whole thing in there. Makes more sense. So this is the kit. They came from Walmart. Um, in my last video, I had a few people comment that they did not like this paint. It did not turn out for them as well. So it's not just me that is not an artist. It's some other people as well, <laughs> apparently. So this is what I'm doing. So I'm going to pour, I'm going to put all the colors together. We're going to do one big pour. This is a 12 by 12 inch gallery wrapped canvas. And this is a dollar store canvas. Um, in my video on Sunday, when I did the, um, the amazing flag, I noticed that the level three canvas, I had holes in both ends. This thing is almost $50. This thing was $3.99 and there are no holes in this one and the wood is just as nice. So I'm throwing that out there. You do not need to buy expensive to play and have fun. So that's my little rant. I'm going to, yeah, so as you noticed, I have it taped, push pinned. My push pins I get at a um, office supply store called Staples. They're also in my Amazon shops. And with that, here we go. We're going to pour out these little cups. I have eight paints, so we've got eight different cups. And we're going to give it a shake. Yes, I quite like the other one. I was impressed that it... Um, uh, My brain's not working. I was impressed how the, um, it's because it's a thicker paint than what I normally use and how it turned out with the uh, balloon smash. It turned out quite nice. So I'm filling it. I'm hoping you can see. I'm not filling it right to the top and I'm 100% sure that there'll be enough paint because that was my issue. I did not have enough paint and I knew that. As you heard me through the video, I said it multiple times that I did not have enough paint. 
so and I quite enjoyed that this was these were on sale for seven dollars and to me I wasn't gonna pay um, 15 just to try it because I quite enjoy you know I don't want to have another thing kicking around because as you see Sherry is an addict and I have so many different things so I've avoided trying these and when it worked out to like two dollars a paint more or less I thought I'd give it a try there we go I could put the oil right in this right into the jar but what if I don't want to use oil? Because like I've explained before, I don't like using the oil because you have to clean. And I'm a less step. I'm a, one of those girls that are um, work smarter, not harder kind of things. So there we go. Now I'm going to put, hopefully it comes out and drops. Uh, probably three drops in there. I'm going to do not all of them. Oh, yeah. So half of them will have paint, uh, the silicone, the other half will not. You can see it on the top. I'm mixing it in. Because the a couple people commented that this particular paint they cannot get it to sell up. So And that's the thing with stuff, right? It's just trial and error. And I love I've expressed this before. Ah, messy Marvin. I love just throwing the camera on and doing something that I have never done before and show you people how real things are that not everything is done perfectly and if something goes awry you can fix it that's the joys of teaching people how to do things right because um not everything yeah i'm just i don't know not everything is done in a fast forward mode so And I apologize. It's funny. I got a, quite a few comments about no video yesterday. And um, they hoped I was fine. Everything was fine. I, oh, because the video was almost two hours long, which is ridiculous. I'm actually making full-fledged movies. Um, I couldn't render it. It wouldn't convert for me. And I was having issues with my computer and my son wasn't home and I was home by myself <laughs> so that was the issue was that I could not get oh there's one more I could not get um it to work right and that's what took so long it took um for the video to convert itself so that I could load it up to YouTube it took me 12 hours ridiculous and then it would get to the end of it and then it would crash and say that it didn't work, but didn't tell me why it didn't work. So that's hilarious. I have a blue finger now. All right, I'm gonna, oh, I had my stitches out. I am so impressed. And look, I can move my thumb backwards. Like I, I am, I am, I'm happy. So I'm gonna put a glove on it, even though it's all um, healed up. It's just a little bit of a scabby thing we got to get rid of, but I'm going to put my gloves on. I'm a naked hand girl, one of those things. I would paint with nothing on my hands. All right, I'm going to move these up this way. All right, we're going to layer our cup. So we have this cup, and I um, boasted about trying to go environmentally. Actually, we're going to, no, I'll leave that one for the other things. Um, but being at the trailer, it's kind of hard. Alrighty, let's just layer some paint. I just hope this is enough. Okay, let's go. Let's see. 
We'll just do, we'll layer them anyway. I want a shorter cup though. Actually, I can wash this cup out because it's only paint. Let's do this. I'm just going to layer it. Any old color, don't matter. Mix them up. They're going to come out. And we're just going to do a flip cup again. And all of this paint is going in. Just gonna scrape it we'll do one more layer and get all of it in and I know this is too much for this little 12 by 12 but we're gonna get it done I have to pay attention I don't get no paint on my carpet <laughs> husband will kill me well not really if you don't see me in a few days you know if something happened with my paints <laughs> let's just get it all in here and we'll put this one It's overkill with me. It's either too much or not enough. And I hope the cells come out. Here we go. All right. Let me just get everything. Sorry, guys. I'm going to keep it all clean or attempt to keep it clean. Um, Wipe off my gloves here. Alrighty. Here we go. We're going to we'll put it in the middle and we're going to... I don't want to touch them. There we go. Didn't want to put my hand in the center of the canvas because it would have been all painted even after I taped it all. We're going to let it sit. Give it a tap. So I'm excited. I'm going to use my casting resin this week. While this is sitting, I'm just going to do a little chit chat. I um, received this mold in the mail a while ago, almost a month ago, and I feel bad because I have not used it yet. And um, this week is the time I'm going to do it. So after I do this video, I'm going to do that one. So I'm excited to do that. It is I think it's called Fundy Mold, and they're from uh, they're from England, but they they have a shipping um, place in the states, so they ship out of the states as well. So I have a discount code and all that fun stuff. So we'll go through all that when I do that video. All right, here we go, guys. Hopefully, I didn't make a mess of it. And get the corners make sure I don't flick the paint all over the place I got a big and again I express this this stinks worse than my resin I can't believe how stinky this is
and they have a gold set um, like metallics but too funny it wasn't on sale so I didn't purchase the, <laughs> the metallic set all right I just want to go. I'll get every little drop out of here. And again, I've stated this in the other video. This is why I, I'm just going to run my fingers along the outside of the canvas, the edging, so that at least there's something on there to, for the canvas, the paint to flow off of. There are some cells going on in there. And again, I probably could have more paint on my outer edge, but pardon me if I'm in your way. There we go. And let it go, my friends. Here we go. Oh, yes, this is better. Just kind of want to get it all to the edging. Bring it to the center. And I want to bring it down. And I don't want to lose this, so I'm going to go quickly over this edge. Just because I don't want to lose. And I did. Oh, well. It is what it is. Perfect. Enough paint. I was just sad I lost all that purpley. I'm just gonna come around and see what's on the front. Actually, that looks good. Okay, I'm gonna remove my glove just so I can grab my torch, which I brought this time. I think I forgot my torch last time I did the video. And let's give it, a, give it a go. Actually, I think if I'm gonna try and see if I can bring this. Aspect, I don't wanna lose that purple. the cells Andrew didn't come out the last time but there's cells it's a shame that there's just oh they're coming up underneath awesome I'm gonna let it sit for a little bit Try and naturally, like it's that dark blue is underneath all of that. Actually, this turned out really good. I'm impressed. Oh. I hate to do this, but I have a gap here. Oh my goodness. I'm going to have to bring this down a little bit. Let it do its thing. That is cool. The sides are so pretty because, oh, I just got this blob of this and this here. I don't like that, but not everything is the way you want to have it done, right? The sides are so pretty. 
when I bring you down, I'll show you the sides. Except for right here, I have a gap. So I'm going to, I'm trying to bring this back down. Let me just, this really needs to, my fingers, I'm sorry guys, you're probably not going to see what I'm trying to do. There we go. I just wanted to have it flow off. But the sad is, it I lost all of that. I'm going to bring it back. Now that it's down there. Because this is beautiful. I'll bring this back and see if I can pull this a little bit more. center and there we go that's good so at least now I've got my edging here is good I will um, show you when we're done well that's I'm impressed we have cells other than it being stinkier than my resin I it's not bad um, they still had some the other day so I might actually go buy another set this would be it cool to do um, some coasters I think on my ceramic tiles I used to do tiles um, but had such an issue with um, putting resin on top of them because of the silicone so we're gonna see how everything plays out with the um, the silicone because as you've seen on the other painting I showed that there was like blobs of it. But I mixed it in really good this time. So hopefully it won't be as bad. So we're going to give it another torch. Sorry, I'm just cleaning off my hands. I'm making sure we got no... Ooh, that's close. No blue paint on the floor. All right, here we go. Torch a little bit more. This looks good all right well there you go guys I love how the colors and the color and the color nice layered look to the to the cells so with that I'm going to put your paws I'm going to um, bring you down without making you seasick and I'll see you guys in just a minute for a close-up so Bob are you enjoying the beach your feet getting wet I hope you're having fun. Watch the painting. See you later, Bob. Okay, we're going to start with the sides. This is your view. So that looks pretty cool. And then we'll come around this way and I'll show you this side. This side looks beautiful. And this is the side I was having the issue with right here, but it, it there was no paint like here so that's good turned out nice and that side well there you go I love how it turned out all of those beautiful cells not too sure about the pink but you guys know I'm not a pink girl so it looks nice looks like a little river running through So there is definitely cells. And you know what? I'm wondering if I'll have to pay attention. You guys probably already know because I get forgetful after I start doing stuff. Those paints here, the pink and the other, I'm wondering if those were the colors that had no silicone in it. That could be that, right? So anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, if you like it, please give it a thumbs up. Um, if you're not yet subscribed, please, please subscribe. 
um, it helps out my channel a lot and hit the bell for notifications so you get uh, notified the next time I have a video and um, in my description box I have the links to my Amazon shops I have the links to uh, crystal resin I have the links to tri art liquid glass I have the links to the wonderful the amazing Laura's art corner um, use my discount code, all capital letters, Sherry Moulton 10%, and you get 10% off your whole entire purchase. And with that being said, there's the link to my PayPal as well. And I hope you guys have a wonderful Wednesday, and I will see you in the next one. Love you guys. Bye.